if I say I'd come, I said, because well, Jimmy, I'm going to tell you something. You can say and make these promises all you want to, but if you want to go to hell, go ahead. Tears came in his eyes. Then the gym. He said, Preacher, I don't want to go to hell. I want to go to heaven with my young ones. I said, you have to be born again. Amen. 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 And he left there, hugged my name and said, pray for me, preacher. He'll fight you over me. But you know what I'll tell him and what I'll tell you? He can love me, and I appreciate that. I love him. And I'll do it. Don't say nothing to him, Mary, just to hurt his feelings. You know, it won't hurt if that's Mary. I'll tell you right now, people better leave preacher Michael alone. Ain't that what he tell her home? But loving me and helping me and saying I'm all right, Jeff, ain't going to get you there. There you go. Lance, me and you love one another till the end of time. But our belief and, and salvation in God is what's going to take us home. Amen. You like that? Amen. 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 Well, the Bible said in verse 1 again, 21. Huh? Thank you. But he that doeth the truth Cometh to the light that his deeds may be made manifest as they are wrought in God. Amen. Did you ever think about the drink of disappointment? Drink something didn't taste right. Nancy might get a little sour and throw it out. I believe that's a lot of times our smell of our salvation going up to God. It's spoiled on us. Amen? You, I'm going to use this little boy over here to come to Ben now. Last Sunday was his birthday. He had waited two weeks. He excited wasn't he Ben about his birthday. Last Sunday was the mention birthday. He was up here fast. You couldn't turn around. Tim went to hunt him a present, and he hunted Tim. <laughs> now I'm going to say something, Mark. We ought to get that excited in hell about Jesus. We'll get up here to this altar. We ought to hunt him. There you go. There you go. Amen. We ought to hunt him. And when we find him, we ought to praise him. Amen. Because of the great deeds he's done for us. Amen. I'm going to do something right there before I read my last scripture. That uh, I hope you uh, don't get all so all up about now because this is good. Aretha, come up here and stand out of here. Does anybody else have a birthday that I forgot? A sin thing has a birthday to it. I'll finish this message, don't worry. Amen. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. God bless you, Rita. Happy birthday to you. Good morning. How kind did you 
preach to folks just like the Amen. I had a good time. I fixed them something to eat and helped them eat it, so you can't beat that. Me and Lucy got the thing going early, and boy, it worked out good. Amen. Give God a hand. It worked out good. Amen. Yeah. Amen. And uh, I learned something about a grill. You put two pieces of an aluminum bowl in it browns the hamburgers better. So in other words, why don't you come to the altar and let God double your blessing and let you get a little bit cleaner. While we're standing, read it, come on, we're going to sing a song. Amen. Ain't God good? Oh, that's so many blessings. Undeserving, that's what we are. I don't deserve nothing he's done for me, but he's been good to me. Amen. Amen. What if uh, Jesus was to come today? What if he'd walk through them doors and say, folks, if all of you love me, <coughs> like you say you do, I want you to know what you tithe next week. <laughs> well, I'm just going to be able to turn over and Bible count and read it. You done good when you tithe, brother. That's what you ain't done nothing. You put a little extra in. The Bible said in Malachi, how I am, how we rob God, and he said, you tithes and offers. Tithes and offers. This little church has been blessed. That's good. That's good. But if you wanted, like the little boy said one time he went to this church, I believe it was Maple Grove. Was up there. They had a plate back then, Jim, on a stool that you put your money in and you come in the church. And he asked his daddy, he said, Daddy, how big a blessing you get today? Well, I thought it wasn't too big. He said, Daddy, how much money did you put in the collection plate? He said, a quarter. He said, see, if you put more in, you've got more out of it. 